The Duchess of Cambridge wowed in a recycled Alexandra McQueen evening dress tonight at a star-studded black tie gala at London's National Portrait Gallery. K37, outshone socialites, fashion gurus and supermodels who gathered for the A-lister fundraiser in the floor-length belted gown embroidered with small white flowers. It was the same dress the Duchess wore when she attended the BAFTAs in February 2017, but the off-the-shoulder gown had been refashioned to include sleeves. Despite a small alteration to the sleeves, eagle-eyed royal fans may recognize Kate's floral black gown from the 2017 BAFTAs. While the outfit used to be off the shoulder, Kate added a matching cap sleeve this time around, making the drop waist dress a little more modest. It's a whole new look. Tonight, Kate teamed it with a pink morganite and diamond earrings by Kiki McDonough, black heels, matching a Prada clutch and her sparkling engagement ring. Kate was in vibrant mood as she mingled with stars such as ex-England football captain David Beckham and his fashion designer wife Victoria. But she wasn't the only royal at the glittering event, her husband Prince William's cousin, Princess Beatrice attended as a guest with her partner Eduardo Mapelimosi for the first time. It was the third time that Kate, patron of the National Gallery, has attended the annual fundraising gala. On arrival she was met by Westminster's Deputy Lord Lieutenant Dr. Paul Knapman and National Portrait Gallery Director Dr. Nicholas Cullinan. Inside she was also introduced to Chairman of the Trustee Board for the Gallery David Ross and Edward Enenfelob, Chairman of the Gala Committee. Afterwards the Duchess chatted to youth team staff Liz Smith and Helen White. Kate, who studied at the British Institute in Florence and the University of St Andrews, also chatted to members of the gallery's youth forum and viewed art produced by the gallery's outreach programs. She met youth team members Hannah Ladmore, Isabella Titherington, Savannah Akampwang and Perpetual PNG. Funds raised on the night go towards a project for the complete renewal of the gallery that will see a significant refurbishment of the building. Kate was also told of the gallery's most extensive program of activities nationwide, with plans to engage audiences on-site, locally regionally and online. Activity includes a UK-wide schools program for teaching history and art, a national skills, sharing collaboration with other museums and galleries and new partnerships with organizations throughout the country. The gallery is home to Paul Emsley's infamous 2012 painting of Kate, her first official portrait which received mixed reviews when it was unveiled just over six years ago. She posed for the artist at his studio in Bradford-on-Avon, Wiltshire followed by another sitting at Kensington Palace in London. He also worked from a series of photos he took of the Duchess. Kate has been royal patron of the National Portrait Gallery since 2012 and last year she wrote a foreword for its Victorian Giants, the Birth of Art Photography Exhibition Catalog, and captions for selected images in the show. In March 2018 she became the first ever royal patron of the Victoria and Albert Museum in London, a role that reflects her interest in the visual arts, photography, design and textiles. The Duchess is also a keen photographer, and an honorary member of the Royal Photographic Society. In addition to being a patron of the gallery, Kate is a self-described enthusiastic amateur photographer, and her favorite subject seems to be her three children, Prince George V, Princess Charlotte III, and Prince Louis X months. She's gotten behind the camera on several occasions including Prince George's first day of nursery school and the first official portraits of Prince Louis, including one where he's being gently kissed on the forehead by big sister Princess Charlotte.